MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. It's the home opener of this new season between the Cincinnati Reds and the Tampa Bay Rays. The crowd is ready to erupt as their guys get set to take the field. Let's join public address announcer Mike Carlucci. And a moment now to glance at the Reds' lineup card in this one. What's the key for them to win this series opener, Harold? Well, Matt, this game's going to be a slugfest. I mean, to me, the key might be getting in that bullpen first. Who scores early? Who's able to get in that pen and just continue Getting to keep the pressure the on the Manning. other club. Stepping Georgia. up to the plate, Eduardo Nunez. He will lead this one off today. Yeah. And here are the Rays as they begin play. Play ball. Here's Ender Inciarte. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. And leading up for the Rays, right fielder, Ender Inciarte. And he gets ahead here with the fastball, strike one. Harold, these Reds as they enter play here this afternoon, they've been fairly punchless of late, losing last time out and, in fact, dropping six of their last seven. Well, we're looking at a ball club that really needs some leadership. They need one person to kind of step up, take his game to another level. They were shut out yesterday. They've been struggling lately. There's nothing flowing. Maybe a big hit, a big home run will ignite them and get things turned around. Alidmus yep. Diaz comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. and oh. Now, that was a good pitch to lay off. When it starts on the outside half of the plate, that slider right there, you know it's going to continue to run off the plate. That misses 2-0. and oh. From the windup, the 2-0 pitch. Hit on the ground to third. And a leap over at first, but he comes down with his foot on the bag to record the out. Batting Two. third, left fielder. Corey At the plate, Corey Dickerson. His lifetime numbers against Bailey. He's gone four for nine. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. And there are the umpires working this one. Calling balls and strikes is Mr. Patrick Johnson. Well, as you know, Matt, most people in the game call him Pat. In the Pat and we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Stepping in, Steven Souza. He'll start to Look, for the Reds. Three. Right fielder, Steven Souza. Standing in, Brad Miller. And Back on Sunday, he picked up a hit in five Second trips baseman. to the plate. Brad Miller. And he oh, takes ball two. one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. A high fastball is in there. We're seeing quite a few pitches up from him right now, and that can obviously be dangerous. A cold strike there, but he might need to lower his sights a little bit. Tries to go the other way as this is in the air to left field. Winkler comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. Batting fifth, catcher. Here's the catcher, Wilson Ramos, and he's been swinging the bat really well in April. He's got that average up over 350 to start the new season. Fastball in there for a called strike. Bottom of the second here with no score. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Hamilton racing back to the track. He makes the play, really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. That was a tough play, so let's take another look at it with show track. Seemed to get a solid read off the bat, took a good angle at it, and he covered over 100 feet to make the grab. And I'm sure he'll be getting some high fives for that one. Here's Marwin Gonzalez now. And he'll watch one miss up and away for a ball, 1-0. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. And that is in there for a two-out base knock. So the bottom of the inning is still alive after the two-out base hit. 
great execution. You hit it where it's thrown, right? That ball's thrown right up the middle. He hit it right back up the middle. A lot of hits in the middle. And now we'll take a moment here at home plate as he asks for time. Standing in, Kevin Kiermeyer. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The 1-0 pitch. A fastball that just misses inside. Look, Matt, he's nibbling. He's nibbling. I know he's upset he didn't get those pitches, but they just miss off the corner. He can't give in now. Just continue to nibble. Here it comes, 2-0. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. So a two-run homer down the line in right field. First home run of the campaign for him. As the Rays move in front now, two to nothing. Yeah, I love a team that keeps fighting with two outs like they did here. The previous batter gets on board with a single, and his teammate does even better with an absolute bomb. That's good baseball. That Stepping in now, Eugenio, Eugenio Suarez. Eugenio As the first pitch Suarez. here's a bit high, it's ball one. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Now with the 2-0 count and the power at the plate, it could be fireworks time. This is the kind of count he makes his money in. Behind on the swing that time, and it's 2-1. and one. Bailey sets his sights. Here's the 2-1. Ball three. It's clear he just hasn't been able to find any rhythm out there. Pretty much unable to hit any of his spots. And now he's at three and one. And he's put him into another great hitting count. Throw goes to Votto over at first. It's in time to retire the side. Digging in now. Number 12. Cincinnati. Third baseman. Number 12. Stepping into the box, Derek Norris will match up with Homer Bailey now to lead off the inning. Derek Norris. Below the knees, one ball, no strikes. Pitch on the way. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. On towards second is Norris. And he is into second base with a leadoff double. Managers these days like to think of that nine-hole hitter as the second leadoff man. Ender Inziarte. He said.
Now pitching for Cincinnati. Number 36. Blake Wood. Three. 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 Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Red, number 52, Tony Cingrani. Yeah, and we knew he was in a groove from the first inning, and he just kept this thing rolling and rolling and rolling. They couldn't get anything going against him. A dominant performance with a complete game shutout. 4 nothing the score this afternoon. Jake Odorizzi gets the win on the mound the his first of the year. The so that's a wrap for the